Now, every episode, we're going to start with Emery hating on a Renegades member. Once more, Summer is feeling embarrassed because uh. of her acne. Morgan congratulated Sun on his birthday. Aw. Oh. Emery and Sun are doing like good siblings that they are. They kept going for a while the mound. I forgot Elphaba was pregnant with twins haha. The thing is, Sun is going to need to be friend with Elphaba for his gen requirements. Let's see if he's luckier than his father. They have an awful compatibility, but good first impressions. Things were going great for them. Until Sun decided to tell a dramatic story, or whatever. She seemed to be liking it. But she hated it. Summer is trying to find a specific kind of frog for one of the potions she needs. She couldn't find it though. Maybe next time. Now, Lilith is here. This is news to me. It's always Caleb Lamau. I was so focused on Lilith and Morgan talking that I forgot I put Emery to blow out the candles. I thought the perfectionist trait didn't fit him, so I only left the adventurous. Of course, I'm choosing the public enemy for him. Now, he's asking Morgan to turn him into a spellcaster. Morgan was unsure because of his behavior. But maybe this will make him behave better? Maybe if he's like his parents and siblings. Maybe he'll feel like he belonged to that family? And of course, he has a want to be enemies with another renegade. He's trying to learn new spells to seek vengeance against them. And apparently he's sick. He has diabetes. He's back at the realm. I didn't expect him to have an attraction for L. She's too old for you, my dude. Oh shit. He has a crush on Alphaba. Not him trash talking Max. This boy did what no one else could. Oh, and there it is the L we know. But why the hell he looks happy about it. Edgar came to visit his niece, and the girl was on the ground while Lou and Vicky were having wicked woo-woo. And I can't even take care of her before they finish what they're doing, because he needs to be introduced. At least he can read a book. This might help them to wait for her parents to finish their business. Now he's asking to get introduced to Leslie. At least they put their clothes on in front of the baby. This is Loki fun to me because Lou and Lilith are canon. The same way Victoria belongs with Vlad. This is so unusual and it's hilarious. While Lou and Vicky can't stop staring at each other, Edgar is spoiling his niece. He's just worried about her because they have anything in this house. What the hell? How are you going to raise a child like that? Awesome. 
When he came back home, he told Rowan about his worries regarding to Leslie's well-being. Rowan listened to it and asked what Edgar is thinking. And he said he was thinking about bringing Leslie here. But he doesn't know if Vicky is going to accept it. Rowan said that whatever he chooses to do, he'll support him no matter what. Caleb and Dawn wasn't what I was expecting to see, but go for it. El Faba texting him that he was right, and Max is a jerk limau. And yes, he has a want to become disliked by Wolfgang. It's Winterfest, and the family came to Realm to celebrate the day, practicing some magic. <laughs> Summer is getting closer to the sages again. She asked Simeon to teach her more potions and also teach some practical magic. Boy, you're too young for Summer. She likes them old. And this is how their Winterfest ended. Yeah. <laughs> Congolite!